Hey creative community, welcome back to my channel Design Dynamo. Today we are diving into the latest and greatest updates in Adobe Illustrator's July 2024 release. Adobe has packed in some incredible new features that are going to supercharge your design workflow. So let's jump right in. Number one, the new feature is Generative Shape Fill, which is powered by latest Adobe Firefly Vector model. You can easily create and fill shapes with detailed vector graphics in your own style. Now guys, let's check it out how it's worked. So here you'll see there is lots of vector graphics. So I'm going to select this vector art, which is butterfly. And I am going to select this and downside here, you will see there is a new option. In the contextual taskbar, you'll see Gen Shape Fill Beta. And there you will fill the outlines of your shape with vector graphics, which is powered by Generative AI. So let's check it out. And I am going to click it here, write a prompt here, spring, flower, and leave simply. And there is an option you'll see shape strength and detail. So you can control how tight or loose your generated graphics will be to your original shape. So there's, you can increase or decrease. So this settings, I'm going to set it. Next option is a style reference and effects. I'm going to click this setting options. So we, we can view all the settings here. Our prompt is spring flower and leaves and this is the setting and under the effects tab I'm going to select flat design, geometric effect and pixel art and color tone is vibrant color and number of color is on auto and hit generate. Now guys let's check it out our options so we're just going to there is three options available here so we're just going to check it out the options now check it out the, our other examples so here we're just going to select this butterfly this time i'm going to change the prompt sunflower and itself when i type some prompt and adobe illustrator which is powered by adobe firefly generative ai it will give you some options so let's right uh, here sunflower blue rises and yellow rose write it here and in this time i'm just going to change the effects like this low poly and color tone to a little bit warm tone and here we're just going to select 10 colors and style reference is same the detail we're just going to increase the detail in this time let's check it out that result look at this guys the three options according to our prompt and that's amazing how quickly you can fill the shapes by using new generative shape fill option now let's check it out other example and this is my channel logo so i'm going to fill this logo with some new generative shape fill beta and we're just going to click this generative shape fill beta and uh, i'm going to write a prompt like floral borders with lily and peaches and here the style strength shape strength and detail we're just going to increase it full and uh, we're just going to select the effects like pixel art, geometric, and color tone to 30 and vibrant color and hit generate. Let's check it out the result. Look at this guys, the result according to my prompt and how quickly generative full beta give you results. And I'm going to select this one and let's select this. And the same prompt and the same settings I'm going to apply from this text as well and hit generate. Now guys, let's check it out the variations according to my prompt. And this variation is match according to my prompt. So how quickly you can create this gen shape fill data, which is on testing modes. Now guys, let's check it out our other examples. Fill this flowers with the help of generative generative shape full beta and i'm going to select it and i'm going to type a prompt tropical leaves and flowers border summer 
flora decoration and this is the big prompt and the strength is tight and here you're just going to increase the detail to maximum and set the effect setting to pixel art and uh, hit generate and look at this guys how beautiful fill with this prompt we can use the same prompt with this flower but this time i'm going to change the effects to like flat is like geometric low poly 3d and hit generate and look at this guys how beautiful result is and very easy to create this type of artwork with the help of new generative shape fill and look at this guys how easy you can create this beautiful vector design by using Gen Shape Fill Beta. Now guys let's check it out the new feature of Adobe Illustrator which is text to pattern. Generate vector patterns using text prompts and which is powered by Adobe Firefly. So first we just draw a score here and go to windows and there is a new option generate patterns beta and there we just going to write a prompt like floral design or any prompt you like it like abstract watercolor illustrations and there is i'm going to select the vibrant color or you can color uh, change any pastel colors and the effect i'm going to use this geometric and hit generate and look at this guys and when you select the option so i like this option this geometric pattern so we're just going to right click here and add to swatches look at this guys when you go to swatches a new pattern is created i'm just going to create the select this rectangle tool and now it is you'll see a new pattern is created and you'll see this is this little pencil icon we're just going to edit our pattern like which going to change the color now guys this is all the new updates of adobe illustrator 2024 so i hope you like this video don't forget to like subscribe my channel design dynamo thanks for watching